Hello again, friend. Here you go. Safest of travels. That, uh, root mother? She ain't all there, is she? Rambling on about constructs and dreamers? Oof. Well, anyway, as long as she's fighting on our side, I'm not complaining. Later. The portent returns. Have you anything of the root for me? I have lost much, but I can offer this. To fare at all is well, child. Good to see you again. Certainly. Be safe out there. If you need anything, ask around. Hello again, friend. Glad to see you back.
speak, outsider. Who is it you serve? <laughs> I suspect that is true. I know your kind. You are Poxoltec. Outsider. Long ago, your good friend, the Paxoltec Ford aided our cause. It is for him I speak to you at all. But Ford is gone now. They question him to find us. Your sympathy is welcome. A queen keeps him in her ziggurat. Ziggurat is easy to find. Ford... is not. This one is... Navun. Once a sentry of the Empress herself. Now, leader of those who resist the nobility. This one is... Navun. Once a sentry of the Empress herself. Now, leader of those who resist the nobility. In truth, it is immortals we fight. The progenitors of the noble lines. The nobles themselves are deceived. The Empress gives them long life to serve her. To serve her, the nobles oppress the Pan. These slaves, the Kolket, are the true victims. They are raised believing they serve immortals, that their place is preordained. But immortality is a lie. The tree that gives the rulers life is dead. Though not all yet know it. For many turns, one of your centuries, perhaps, nobles trapped his men in a cave, slaughtered everyone. At least this is what we thought. I found Ford far from the cave, wounded, near death. I healed him, helped him return home. I wish I could help him now. But too much is at stake. It is me they want. Ford... ...understands this. Yes. He returned many times. Gave us aid. Weapons, strategies, knowledge from his world. He said his... Uh, ...America was... ...familiar with rebellion. Last time he came was... Twenty turns ago. He said he would stay. Live with us. <laughs> Even fight alongside us. I was glad. Very glad. But... Nobles knew. <clears throat> Ambushed him. Took him. He does not return. I was the sentry of the Empress, and shared in the fruit of life. I have lived hundreds of your years. It is many turns since I ate the fruit, yet even now I age only slowly. That is a long story. Do you really want to hear it? For ages upon ages, the Empress controls the nobility by controlling the Thean, the Tree of Life. Fruit of the Thean makes them immortal. <laughs> but the tree is long dead, a secret known only to the Empress's house. The nobles suspect, but so long as they receive fruit preserved in the Empress's storehouse, they do not question. I... knew this. Despised this. Yet I continued to serve. Immortality is... a seductive master. Many think as you do. Supplies dwindled. Nobles grumbled, quibbling over a lie. While remote villages suffered. I saw their suffering. I did nothing. Finally, to appease the nobles, the Empress accused the village Zoka of stealing. 
I was among those sent to execute them. The villagers were innocent. Families. Children. I turned on my Empress that day. I fight her ever since. May you find what you seek. Yesha greet you, Paxel Tech. Do you need Navun's aid? This one is Navun. I wish you well, Paxel Tech. 